everyone welcome back to my channel so today i'm going to be telling you some tips on how to fill your sketchbook so the first thing i suggest you to do is think of the first five things that come to your mind and write it down on a piece of paper then you could later draw an illustration of that now this doesn't mean you need to follow exactly all the prompts this you just need to basically follow one and the main reason for doing this is to kind of get you an idea of what you want to draw now also you don't have to try your hardest or think it has to be the best drawing in the world it only has to be a little draft and it's just a small sketch but i was kind of proud of mine i must say i do like it so anyways go get your creativity flowing and start drawing now the next tip is to get out of your comfort zone and i don't know how to explain this per se let's just say that not exactly don't draw what you don't want to draw just draw what you don't normally draw but it's something that you actually like drawing so in this case i drew a house because i do actually like drawing houses but i rarely draw draw them and so try to find something that you rarely draw and kind of draw it i feel like if you completely get out of your comfort zone and draw something completely new you will be discouraged on how the end result turns out so yeah now my next tip is to go on youtube and go click on a random song and say or draw how the song makes you feel so for example if the song makes you feel happy and sunshine and rainbows then you draw sunshine and rainbows and if it doesn't then well you don't draw sunshine and rainbows wow great line Neha. <laughs> anyways so basically this will just give you a little idea of what you want to draw other than being completely blank and no creativity whatsoever at least you kind of have a basic start on what you're trying to approach or the idea that you're trying to fulfill of course you could change anything in the song so for example if you don't actually want this thing in the song to be in your drawing then you don't have to draw it no one's gonna judge so yeah hope that helps now these are just some three simple and easy tips on how to fill up your sketchbook when you don't know what to draw or just what you should draw or what you should draw when you don't know what to draw in general anyways i really hope you like the video and make sure to subscribe without further ado bye